The Namibia Correctional Service, NCS, started experiencing a shortage of medical doctors after the Office of the Prime Minister stopped allocating professional allowances. NCS has also been unable to counter the salaries paid to doctors from the Ministry of Health and Social Services, along with fixed overtime. The Commissioner General notified government of their predicament, saying this has forced NCS to rely on state hospitals to treat inmates. We are the uniform personnel and our doctors. The, the principle is that the health which is provided in the outside, in public, supposed to be the same as that one provided in the correctional service. The challenge, however, is that the inmates are treated in crowds and sometimes those needing special treatment are not prioritized. In the past, the NCS could employ foreign medical doctors, mostly from neighboring Zimbabwe, but they have struggled to maintain these expertise. On average, the state institution can only offer these doctors $25,000 per month. We get a court order to employ doctors. Then now the problem is here. When we employ a doctor, if we were, if we are advertised to employ a doctor, we his the salary way is getting while she's at the Minister of Health is supposed to be reduced to come to coroner's facility service. Who is going to agree to reduce his salary? Prime Minister Sarah Gugongelwa Amadila instead called for discussions between ministries, emphasizing that state institutions operate within the allocated resources. Discussions would help us to, to find ways out of difficult situations. Although we may not fully achieve what we want to achieve, we can mitigate the, the negative consequences. The NCS sits with an offender population of over 4,000 and NBC News could not establish the exact number of inmates needing special medical treatment. Blanche Corres, NBC News, Ventuk.